Hello students, welcome to my channel. This video contains class 7 general knowledge Olympiad. Previous year paper 2022 question paper set A. You can also find the sample paper for the current year 2023 in my channel. I have given the link in the description box. Please do watch. And you can also find other Olympiad papers of class 7 in my channel. I have given the playlist link in the description box. Please do watch. Before going to the video, please do subscribe my channel for more videos. Let's move into the video now. The first section is its general awareness. Question number one. This insectivorous plant belongs to Lentibularaceae family and possesses leaves which are greenish yellow in color and secretes sticky mucilage to trap the insects. Identify the plant. Options are butterwort, pitcher plant, a venus, a flytrap, sundew. Right answer is it's option A, butterwort. Question number two, water hyacinth, which is a free-floating weed and infest India's waterways. Choking of plants, fish and animal growth is a native of Australia, France, South America, North America. Right answer is it's option C, South America. Question number 3. To be filled up as a tiny sacs filled with red, yellow and brown pigments to absorb light of different wavelengths and can alter color, pattern and texture of its skin anytime. It shows dynamic camouflage. Options are blob, fish, cuttlefish, blue tank and hammerhead shark. The right answer is it's option B, cuttlefish. Question number 4. Who among the following is considered as the milkman of India? Option A. Varghese Korean. Option B. Siv Nadar. Option C. Kansham Das Birla. And the option D is Nirpak Tudach. Right answer is it's option A. Varghese Korean. Question number 5. It was one of the five deadliest hurricanes to have ever hit the United States in 2005. It devastated the coastal areas of the Gulf Coast states of Alabama, Louisiana, and Mississippi, causing over 1,800 facilities identified. Options are Hurricane Alex, Hurricane Irma, Hurricane Camille, and Hurricane Katrina. The right answer is it's option D, Hurricane Katrina. Question number 6. Select the incorrect statement. Statement 1. Acid rain is caused due to sulfur dioxide and nitrogen oxides present in atmosphere. Option B is smog is a type of air pollution that reduces the visibility. Then statement 3 is C is soot is formed due to the incomplete combustion of hydrocarbons. Then option D is none of this. So the none of the option is incorrect here. All the statements which is given over here are correct. So option D, none of this is the right answer. Question number 7, who among the following is not an Indian mathematician? Option A, Brahmagupta. Option B, Bhaskara 2. Option C, Aryabhata. And option D is Banabhata. The right answer is, it's option D, Banabhata. Question number 8, he was a British physicist who was born in Manchester on December 18, 1856. He was awarded Nobel Prize in Physics in 1906 in recognition of the great merits of his theoretical and experimental investigation on the conduction of electricity by gases. Who was he? J.J. Thomson, Richard Feynman and Niels Bohr, Charles Babbage. The right answer is it's option A. J.J. Thomson. Question number 9. The Gadget. Shown below is cleaning tool, an entirely automated machine that allows floor cleaning with minimal human intervention identified. Options are robotic vacuum cleaner, canister vacuum cleaner and option C is handheld vacuum cleaner and then option D is none of this. The right answer is it's option A, it's robotic vacuum cleaner. Question number 10, this planet is named after the Roman god of war. It is the second smallest planet in the solar system. Identify the planet. Options are Venus, Mars, Mercury, Earth. The right answer is it's option B, 
Mars. Sheet number 11, match column 1 with the column 2 and select the correct option. In column 1, waterfall name is given and then in column 2, the place of the waterfall is given. So, the first one is it's Angel Falls, which is located in, in Venezuela. Then, Tugela Falls is located in South Africa. Then, Brownie Falls is located in New Zealand and Jock Falls located in India. So finally your answer is its option C. She number 12 to be filled up is the inner and larger moon of Mars. Phobos, Deimos, Callisto, Lapidus. The right answer is its option A. Phobos. She number 13. A waste management technique that involves the use of organism to remove or neutralize pollutants from a contaminated site is known as biomagnification, bioremediation and waste degradation, bioreduction. The right answer is its option B, bioremediation. Question number 14. In which language would you greet people saying Buenos Dias? French, German, Spanish, Italian. The right answer is its option C, Spanish. Sheet number 15. This fort is one of the largest fort complexes in Rajasthan. There are seven gates or entrances of this fort. Rampal, Lakshmanpal, Padanpal, Ganeshpal, Jodhalapal, Bairanpal and Hanumanpal. Identify this fort. Options are Amber Fort Jaipur, Ratambur Fort, Savai Madapur and Gagran Fort Jalawar. And Chitagar Fort, it's Chitagar. The right answer is it's option D, Chitagar Fort, which is situated in Chitagar. Sheet number 16 Raja Tarangini, a chronicle of the kings of Kashmir, was written by Kalhana, Jiavuddin Barani, Mirza Nathan, and Amir Kushrao. The right answer is it's option A. Kalhana. Question number 17. To be filled up is an instrument used to show the direction of wind and to be filled up is used to measure its speed. Which instrument is used to show the direction of wind is a wind van and which is used to measure its speed is its anemometer. So option A is the right answer. Number 18, which of the following places is also known as Kapachan? Options are Rajasthan, Ladakh, Haryana, Azam. The answer is it's option B, Ladakh. Question number 19, this English author is also known as the Bard of Avon. He has written many books like Romeo and Juliet, Hamlet, Macbeth, etc. What is the name of this author? William Shakespeare, Charles Dickens, William Blake and Thomas Hardy. The right answer is it's option A. William Shakespeare. Question number 20. What is the meaning of the idiom? A dime a dozen. Avoid saying what you mean. Something common and of very little value. Not being critical. Or making a choice between two equally unpleasant alternatives. The idiom a dime a dozen means it's option B, something common and of very little value. Sheet number 21, in the story, The Snow Queen, which character succeeds in finding her friend Kai and saving him from the Snow Queen? Options are Elsa, Jeda, Yukumi and Thumbelina. It's, the answer is, it's option B, it's Jeda. Sheet number 22. In which year capital of India was shifted from Calcutta to Delhi? 1947, 1922, 1908, 1911. The right answer is its option D. 1911. Sheet number 23. Who among the following was the creator of Tom and Jerry? A William Hanna and Joseph Barbera, Pran Kumar Sharma, Rajiv Silaka and Hank Ketchum. The right answer is, it's option A, William, Hannah and Joseph Barbera. 
Question number 24. She is a news journalist and founder, editor of a digital platform named Mojo Story. She got famous after her frontline war, reporting on Kargil war between India and Pakistan. She was awarded with Badma Shri in 2008. Identify her. Option A, Sharin Ban. Option B, Sucheta Dalal. Then option C is Sagarika Ghosh. Then option D is, yes, it's, her name is, it's Barka Dutt. Barka Dutt. So the right answer for this question is, it's option D, Barka Dutt is the right answer. The answer for this question is, it's option D, Barka Dutt. Question number 25, identify the Yogasana shown in the given picture. Option A, Anantasana. Option B is Astavagarnasana. Option C is Balasana. And option D is Bekasana. So the right answer is, it's option A, A, Anantasana. Question number 26. Select, select the incorrect match of football stadium and its location. Option A, Old Trafford Stadium in England. Option B, Santiago Bernabeu Stadium in Spain. Option C, San Siro Stadium in Italy. Then option D is a Wembley Stadium in South Africa. So which is the incorrect match one here? Yes, it's option D. Wembley Stadium in South Africa is the wrong one. Question number 27. Who among the following cricketers has scored the most runs in one day international cricket? Options are Ricky Ponting, M.S. Dhoni, Hashim Amla, Sachin Tendulkar. The right answer is, it's option D. Sachin Tendulkar. Question number 28. Which of the following Venn diagrams best represents the relationship amongst animals, horse and dog? So just go through it. Animals, horse and dog. This is horse and this is dog. And both would come under the category of animals. Right. So which is the best suit for the Given relationship, it's option C is the right answer. Question number 29. A certain sum of money amounts to Rs. 730 in 3 years and 805 in 8 years at a certain rate of simple interest. Find the sum. Let's find out the answer now. Let's do it. See, the question given here is a certain sum of money amounts to Okay, amounts to 730 in 3 years. And again, and rupees 805 in 8 years at a certain rate of simple interest. Right. Then find the sum. Sum means it's nothing but the principal amount. It's nothing but principal amount. Okay. Now, how to find the principal amount? Here they have given you the amount. So, what is the formula for amount? To find the amount, yes. Amount is equal to principal plus interest. Correct. So, this 730 is nothing but the interest of 3 years is being added to the principal amount. Okay. In the same way here, 805 in 8 years means the interest for 8 years is being added to the principal amount so that we are getting 805. We have to find what is the principal amount. Let's do it. First, we have to find out uh, what is the difference difference in amount. We have to find out what is the difference in what is the difference of amount. Here we have two amounts, right? One is 730 in three years and 805 in three years. So difference of amount. First we have to find out. That is 730, sorry, 805 minus 730. So, which gives you rupees 75. Okay, here what is the 75 rupees? 730 becomes 805 in another 5 years, which means this is the interest. This is the interest, interest, interest of 5 years. How, it, how the 5 years came? Yes. We will find out what is the difference of year. Because from 3 years to 5 years. No. 8 years. Right. 8 years. So, 8 minus 3 which is equal to 5 years. So, 
this 75 rupees is nothing but interest of 5 years okay now we'll write over here interest of 5 year is equal to 75 rupees then what is the interest for this is the interest of 1 year that we can find out now that is 75 divided by 5 which gives 15 rupees so every year the interest would be adding every year the interest amount 15 rupees would be adding to the amount correct right now we got the interest part. now here it is given that the amount of 730 in 3 years for set time rate of simple interest right here we got what is the interest for 1 year in the same way I can find what is the interest of what is the interest of this 3 years how much I will get I would get 15 into 3 is equal to 45 rupees right so we have already we have the formula that is amount is equal to principal plus I what is the amount in 3 years it is 3 730 we don't know the principal amount but we know what is the interest for three interest for three years that is so principal amount is equal to 730 principal amount is equal to 730 minus 45 so when you subtract you will be getting 685 rupees so this is the sum that is 685 rupees and also in the same method you can also find using this 805 amount in 8 years also first you have to find what is the uh, interest of 8 years from the from the interest you can subtract 805 you will be getting 685 in the same in that way also you can find out okay so finally your answer is its option c question number 30 which of the following does not belong to the category of magnetic storage devices of computer? Hard disk, floppy disk, a pen drive, both A and B. The right answer is it's option C, pen drive. The next section is current affairs. Question number 31. Who among the following is the current director of National Council of Educational Research and Training, that is NCRT? Dinesh Prashad Saklani, Vinith Joshi, Manoj Ahuja, none of this. The right answer is it's option A, Dinesh Prashad Saklani. Question number 32. Which airport has been named as the world's best airport in the World Airport Awards 2022 held in Paris, France? Options are Hamad International Airport, Singapore Shanghai Airport, Narita International Airport, Paris Charles D. Gauley Airport. The right answer is it's Hamad International Airport. Number 33. When is world number when is world no tobacco day observed every year? 15th April, 9th July, 30th April, and 31st May. The right answer is it's option D 31st May. Shin number 34. Which of the following countries has owned the 2022 Pan American Cup organized by the Pan American Hockey Federation? Options are Chile, Canada, Argentina, Australia. The right answer is it's option C, Argentina. Question number 35. Who is the Prime Minister of Israel? Option A, Naftali Bennett. Option B, Benjamin Netanyahu. Then option C is Yar Lapid. Then option D is none of this. So the Prime Minister of Israel is it's option C, Yar Lapid. Question number 36. What is India's rank in the World Press Freedom Index 2022? Options are 29th, 47th, 150th and 98th. The right answer is it's option C, 150th. Question number 37. Who among the following is the current head coach of Indian women's cricket team? Option A, Urkeri Raman. Option B is Ramesh Pawar. Then option C is Rahul Ravid. And option D is none of this. So the right answer is, it's option B, Ramesh Pawar. Question 
क्वेश्चन नंबर थर्टी एट इन मे ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी टू बॉर्डर रोड्स ऑर्गेनाइजेशन कंप्लीटेड द एक्सर्वेशन ऑफ अ नेचिपू टनल इन ऑप्शन आर अरुणाचल प्रदेश असम मिजोरम सिक्किम द राइट आंसर इज इट्स ऑप्शन ए अरुणाचल प्रदेश Question number thirty-nine. With which of the following countries has India tied up with to convert one fifty villages into villages of excellence in twelve states of the country? Options are Israel, Germany, Canada, Iraq. Option A, Israel is the right answer. Question number forty. How many Badma Vibhushan awards were given in the year twenty twenty-two? Options are six, fourteen, nine, four. The answer is it's option D. Four Padma Vibhushan awards. The next section is life skills. Question number forty-one. The term aptitude refers to natural ability or skill, a lack of talent or ability, lack of excitement or enthusiasm, then lack of knowledge. The right answer is it's option A. Natural ability or skill. Question number forty-two. The overall sense of personal value. and self worth is known as attitude self esteem personality all of this the right answer is it's option b self esteem question number 43 if you are participating in an inter school football match then you should hurt the opposing team members start crying on losing the match accept victory or defeat like a true sportsman use unfair means to win option c is the right answer Question number forty-four: Which of the following road signs is used for a narrow road ahead? Yes, it's option D is the sign road sign for narrow head or narrow road ahead. Question number forty-five: Your friend's father is hospitalized and is in critical condition. your exams are near the corner but your friend is unable to attend the school then what should you do option a prepare notes for him or her so that he or she can study option b ask him or her to give the exams next year option c focus on your own studies and ignore him or her then option d is all of this right answer is it's option a prepare notes for him so that he can study option a is the right answer The next section is achiever section. Question number forty-six. Read the given statement carefully and select the option that currently identifies true and false ones. The first one is granite is an example of intrusive igneous rock. Statement two: When an earthquake strikes, yell waves are the first wave to hit the seismograph. Statement third is extensive deposit of loess are found in northern China. So the first statement. Granite is an example of intrusive igneous rock. Is it's true? Then, when earthquake strikes, L waves are the first waves to hit the seismograph. It's false. And again, third statement again, it's true. So, option B is the right answer. Question number forty-seven. Match the column and select the correct option. In column one, English word is given, and in column two, the meaning of the English word is given. So here the options are given here. Column one English word. What is it? It's almana. Question number forty-seven. Match the column and select the correct option. In column one English words is given. In column two corresponding meanings are given here. The first one is almana. So what is the meaning of the word? Yes. It's a book published every year, containing important dates and statistical information. Then second one is it's crusade. The meaning of the word is a vigorous campaign for political, social, or religious change. Then option th three is it's inevitable. It's mean a situation that is unavoidable. Then last one is it's regalia, which means the emblems and symbol em symbols. Sorry, the emblems and symbols of royalty so finally what would be the answer yes it's option b is the right answer 
Question number 48. Read the given statement carefully and select the incorrect ones. First one is Rajat Sharma, the host of Aap Ki Adlat in Editor-in-Chief of India TV. Then statement 2 is Sveta Singh is a famous news anchor in G News. Then option 3 is Arnab Goswami is a famous TV news presenter at BBC. So which is the incorrect one here? Yes, here option statement 2 and 3 are incorrect here. So your answer must be its option B is the right answer. Question number 49. The marks in a subject for 15 students are as follows. Some 15 data are given. That is mark of 15 students is given over here. We have to find what is mean of the data. Then median of the data and mode of the data. Okay. So what you people will do. Whether you will start with the median of the data. Because obviously the first statement is median of the data. So obviously we will start with the. To find what is mean of the data. Correct. Correct. Okay. So, what is the formula for to find the mean? What is the formula for to find the to find the mean of a data? Yes. So, mean is nothing but average of the given data. We have the formula for this. That is sum of all observation. Sum of all observation is divided by total number of observation. Okay, so what is total number of observation here? 15 students know, so that is total number is 15. But sum of all observation means we need to add all the given data, that is 15 data we have to add. Okay, so during the exam point of view, if you are adding all the 15 data, it will consume more time and it may happen, some error may happen while adding because, because it is not possible to add all the 15 numbers within very, very fast, right? It, it sometimes sometimes you will may you will make a mistake while adding so some error may happen right so to avoid this what we have to do means we'll just skip the first part right because we can we have some other part also that is second one is that median of the data then we can find mode of the data right so which is easiest one um, mean median mode which is very easy to find the answer yes exactly mode of the data the finding the mode of the data is very easier one comparing with the other okay so what is the first step to find the mode of the data? Yes, we have to arrange the given data in ascending order. That is must. Even for finding the median as well as for mode, you have to arrange the given data in ascending order. So first we have to arrange the number. Right now, first we will take down the 6 series. 68, 64 here. Okay, only 2 data. So 64, 68. Then we'll move on to the 7 series number here 70. So it must be next number must be 70. Here 72. 72. Okay. Then we have 78 only. Then we'll move on to the 8 series number that is 18. We have 82 here. Then 83 we have. Then 84 also we have. Then 85 also we have. So we'll write down 83. 84, 85. Then 86 also we have. Okay, we have written. Then 9 series number is there. Which is here. Okay, 90. So 90 is there. A 92 is there. Then which is left out. Okay, 2 95s are there. Then we will write out. Okay, what is mode of the data? Yes. The data which is a present or which occur higher frequency in the given set of datas. Yes, obviously in the given set of uh, data, that is in, among the 15 data, uh, the value of 95 is present twice. So it, the number 95 has the highest frequency. So the mode of the data is 95. Just move on to the option. Which uh, option holds the right answer for the third one? It's option B and C only hold the right answer. Which means option A and D is the wrong answer. Right. Now we have find out some something. We have come to know. Yes, we have only two options. That is either B or C could be the answer. Then we will find out median of the data. Okay. So what is median of the data? Yes, we have to find the a middle number. We have to find the middle number of the given data. How will you find? Very simple. The given number, given data in is an odd number. So first what we have to do means first we will strike out the first and the last. Again, second and the second last. And the third and the third last. Write down 
like this you cancel then you will find the middle number yes i got my middle number that is it's 83 so option c only holds the right answer for the second so what does that mean it's option b is also wrong one so finally option c is the right answer so without finding the mean of the data we could be able to find our answer so this is the way you have to think so finally option c is the right answer for this question otherwise if you want to know if you want to find the mean of the data first means you just go okay you can find the mean of the data then you will then you will solve one by one that's all up to you but this is the tip you have to follow while doing the exam okay next the question is 50th question select the incorrect statement about a computer network it is a collection of two or more computer system linked together it can either be wired or wireless it allows sharing of resources it does not allow to access remote computer so which is incorrect about computer network is yes, it's op it's option d it does not allow to access remote computers hope you all like this video thanks for watching